Hey guys, I'm out here in my pajamas this morning and whoa, do we have a New Year surprise. I am so excited. I've given the chickens all the leftovers. We are sick of leftovers, but no, no, get back Casper. I just gotta show y'all what we've got. I'm so excited guys, I am so excited. I heard it and I thought, that sounds like, <gasps> And I took off out here to the barn, and you will not believe. Let's get on out here so y'all can see. Yes, yes. Yes, yes, mommies. Look. Look. What? Oh, man. Oh, man. Let's see what we got. Oh, look at there. Look at that! We have two little teeny tiny babies! Yeah! Look at there, Mama! Come on, Mama! Let's get these little babies and put them back up! Come on! Yeah? Come on, Mom! Oh, look at there! Look at there! And? I think it's a girl! Come on, Mama! Mama! Look at those hurt you, baby! Come on, Mama! Mama! Here. Mama. Mama. Come on. Yeah. Out. Out you go. Out, all of y'all except Mama. Come on, Mama. Come on. I got you, baby. Look at this little thing. Ain't that just sweet as it can be? Look at Lightning checking it out. Yeah. Come on, Mom. Mama. Mom! Yeah. No, don't lock us in, Lightning. <laughs> Mama, come on. We got to get these other critters out of the way so we can lock them up in one of the stalls. Yeah. Uh-huh. Look, y'all are not being cooperative. Let me uh, pause this until I can get her and her babies in here, but I am so excited, guys. Okay, got us an old tarp hung up here to block the wind for these babies. Still got the horse and the other sheep's uh, salt here. And, well, I got the shavings down and the baby's all caught up. Mom's over there being a good mom. She's done fed them babies. That's a good sign. So, I feel pretty secure now. Okay, guys, here is another view of them, another picture, and here's this crazy goat that we can't keep in the fence. And, guys, here we are with this psycho rooster. For some reason, he does not like me, and that's our crazy yard goat. We can't keep her, her in. She comes right through those goat panels like it's nothing. She does the Houdini act. And I figured he was fixing to attack me, but I Bye. think uh, Rosie the Fearless kept him away. <laughs> Thank goodness. There you go. <laughs> like that stuff, don't you, babe? Okay, I'm giving this mom some good fresh dried alfalfa to keep up her strength. Two toots. Can we see these babies? Can you let us see them? and inspected them, but she didn't go over there and butt and carry on bark and act fool because that mama would have got her and I think she figured that stuff out being a mom herself. Well, she's not a mom, but being a girl. So she stayed back out of the way, thank goodness. But anyway, I came back to the house and I told my husband, I said, I'm going up there to get the horse trailer. And he says, why? And I said, I caught the sheep. He said, you did not. I said, I did. And I got her in the, in a, 
stall in the little horse trailer. So we loaded up and went and got the trailer and brought her home and we backed it right up to the gate and opened it up where she didn't have anywhere to go but in the stall. Enough dreaming about babies. We got to get to work on this fence around the garden. These others just gonna go that way, so I'll have to untie my string and tie it from here to that way. So you don't need another one here. I may end up putting one in between them, but if I don't have to, I ain't. Yeah. <coughs> I believe you gotta tie something in there. Like so? It's a pretty good stretch here. Yeah. About the stretch we got over there. Yeah, but you might have got something to tie the fence at the top with. Oh, well, I was going to run a strand of that barbless wire that we got up there and fasten it off to it there. Yeah. But, you know, yeah. if you think we need to put another one in between there and go get some off. Yeah, you know, it's... I would, but I do things overkill. So if you I mean, think it'll work... just the garden, you know. Well, That's what I'm thinking. Okay. It's not to keep animals in, it's to keep them hopefully yeah. out. I may have to come off of my wire there. That's another reason I don't want to try to put a top thing on there if I don't have to. And stick some ups and put another, like that wire or something up above it. To keep them from flying in. <clears throat> but we'll see if that's necessary when the time comes. Okay, good enough, good enough. Yeah, that's why I had my coat off. When you yeah. walk through these shady spots, you get cold. When you well, walk out in the sun, you get warm. Well, I was walking up here at the barn, working in the barn and around the barn. I guess the wind was blocked more. Rosie. Come on. Okay, hit that bell, subscribe, and the like button.